Hello everyone. Well friends, as promised, we are talking about socks today. Sounds like a Dave situation. Okay, are we ready for this? Dave says, The other day I was going for a run wearing white crew socks and I experienced some strange interactions. Is it okay to wear taller than ankle length socks for running? <laughs> I feel like I don't have enough information to answer this. First of all, Dave, why do you immediately blame the socks when you have strange interactions with people? I don't know what else you were wearing. Were you doing something weird? I mean, were you like running in a place you shouldn't be running? There's a lot of factors, but let's just go with the socks. It seems like you've somehow narrowed it down to that. So remember, when in doubt, always wear what's comfortable and practical for your lifestyle, and that applies double for when you're playing sports or doing something active. That said, running socks typically come in no-shows, quarter-length, or sometimes knee-high compression socks. No-show socks are best for when you're running on a track or just around the neighborhood, and then you want to make sure that you get the ones that have the tab on the back of the heel so that they don't slip down inside your shoe because I've had that happen while running and that's not very comfortable. Quarter length styles are better for trail running where you might get dirt or rocks in your shoes otherwise, but they do give you more of a tan line. And some people wear knee high compression socks for certain benefits, but I understand that these are usually worn after a workout. So Dave, those are your basic running sock options, and there's no reason you can't wear an athletic crew sock to go running. Um, it's just gonna give you that much more obvious of a tan line if you're wearing them with shorts. I will often wear a crew sock in winter under pants if I'm running outside just for that extra warmth. So if it's summer, it'll just be that much cooler to wear a shorter sock is all. So do what you want. If you really want to make sure you're wearing the correct socks for running, I would recommend going to an actual running store because the important thing here is actually not the length as much as the fabric. All right, Dave, I hope these sock tips help you navigate whatever society you're running through. If you have any thoughts about socks that you'd like to share with the class, please leave those in the comments. And if you have any questions about socks or anything else about style, you can send that to abby at thegooddresser.com. Thanks for watching and make sure to come back next week for How to Dress Feminine. See you then. In the meantime, make the world a better looking place.